Westford Academy is welcoming a new student this spring, and she has quickly become the most popular person there. She used to be a student there years ago and had to quit to get a job. Now, 94-year-old Genevieve Johnson is back in class, and as she tells me, she is ready to finish what she started seven decades ago. It is a busy Tuesday at Westford Academy. In the middle of all the talking and texting and teenagers is one student who quietly stands out. They have chicken noodle soup. You want I'll that? have chicken soup. Right, we'll Genevieve that Johnson too. is 94 and going back in time. I don't think I could have got through without you. She's got her senior friends, Christina Grace and Caroline, by her side and leading the way as she goes back to the high school she almost graduated from. Did you ever think you would do this? No. <laughs> Never in my life I expected. I expected to go to class and be like a normal school kid. Genevieve had just two and a half credits remaining when she left school. It was the depression and she needed to work. Now, 78 years later, she's getting a do-over. It means that I will gladly say that I get a high school education, which I've always wanted. And here I am, and I'm going to finish. Genevieve was supposed to graduate in 1936 from Westford Academy, back when this was just a one-room schoolhouse, and things have certainly changed a lot since then. It isn't the same as when I went to school. We had homework, naturally, but not as much as they do today. This is amazing. This was an easy uh, need to meet. The school invited her back when they heard it was her lifelong dream, but what they didn't expect was what she would offer them. Stay in school. I never had the chance. She became the most popular person on campus, doling out advice and teaching lessons of her own. If you go to school, you get the education and you feel proud that you finished school. And seeing her in class so attentive is just, it's really cool to see it. Let me grab your notebook. From English to U.S. history, even acting, she can finally see the finish line, a victory, a lifetime in the making. Nice to be back. a girl. She is taking 12 classes and then will meet all her requirements. She can't technically get a diploma because you must take the MCAS now to get that, but she will get a certificate of attendance. She will walk at graduation, and she is so excited. She said this is the one thing she regretted in her life. She is adorable. She's amazing. And it's great to see the kids with her all hanging out, even taking the selfie. And they love her. The MCAS? Come on, because of that she can't get a diploma? I know. I know. We need to fix that. What about her life experience? I know. I oh, know. Boy. Hopefully that'll change. But she is excited to cap and gown and walk. And she's been asked to the prom. She's a little nervous about that, so we'll have to wait and see All if right. she's going to go. <laughs> we'll be watching. We'll be on prom watch.